Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another plant video today. And today's video is kind of special in honor of Valentine's Day. Jesse took me to five different plant nurseries and we ended up filming a little bit at each place. Um, so I will go ahead and show you that footage and then I'll show you the plants I ended up getting. The first place we went to is Nick's Gardens here in Aurora. So here's the footage from there. I like this guy, but he's $90. <laughs> oh. Really cool though. Look how big. This is the one you liked? It looks like a... I don't even know. They got an old man cactus. 150. This guy? Golden barrel cactus. 250. This is what I've been wanting, Jewel Orchid. But it's $44.99, so I'm not sure. <laughs> I think if I were to get one, I would get probably this one, because it has the most like vine part. This thing, $500. We have a lot of little succulents here. Donkey tail. Some Haworthias. Lots of little baby cacti. What is this? Never heard of it. Bunch of little jades. Oh yeah. I might have to do a voiceover. Anyway. <gasps> Look at this one. Campfire. I don't have one of these. I think they're really cute though. I don't know. I haven't been that great with succulents lately. During summer, more so. It's a cute little tapestry thing. Yeah. Get this thing. 120. I kind of want another one of these. I only have one of these exact kind. He needs a friend. They have so many of them too. Are these little ones or the ones you're just looking at? This is jade. Oh. It's a succulent. It's bonsai. Oh, they're starting. They're getting ready for spring and summertime over there. So many. I don't feel like I could keep one of these alive. They're cool though. Were these? 
So cute. Look at this one. They have the the raindrop peperomia that I didn't get from City Floral last time. I'm on a steak already. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can I keep seeing these and they're so pretty, but they need like tons of humidity. Turn around and look out. It's your favorite. <laughs> My favorite. Do I need another one? <laughs> what are these? Oh, hibiscus. It smells really good. Peperomia Rosso, $8.99. This fern is what I wanted. The little, the heart fern. Really cute. I don't like ferns, but this one is adorable. Lots of little philodendron. A Monstera for $12.99. Lots of pofos. So we just left Nick's Gardens and we are on our way to City Floral. Um, we were here a couple weeks ago, but I'm hoping they got a new shipment in. String of dolphins. They have a lot of it too. Yeah, it's the little TLC area. This one would be actually fine if you just cut away the dead parts there. Look at that poor thing. What? 
<laughs> the route. That's okay. I like these really cute painted pots. It does. I know. There's all the ZZ plants. This is the same one that I always see at the mall that I say, oh, I want a cutting. But you don't. <laughs> I just want to say that I grew it from a plant from the mall. <laughs> this is a cool snake plant. It doesn't say what kind. It's pretty. Do not water. <laughs> Lots of pothos and partly philodendron. My favorite again. So pretty in here. We'll keep going this way and then turn back around, maybe. Alocasia Polly, 1999. Mine is a single leaf right now. These guys again, I still ne did not get one. <laughs> I'll get one someday. Oh, they have Peperomia Frost. $6.99? Okay, I'm getting one. We'll come back for it, though. Pretty begonias. I don't know what this is, some kind of pilea. It's pretty. Look at the little baby chaffleras. They look just like mine. So cute. This is really cool. What is that? Those variegated salmon. <laughs> I don't know what that is. It's cool though. It's like I like that. <laughs> oh, it's flowering. Trying to show the price on this one. These are really cool cacti. Is that the one you bought? Is that what it does? Yeah. The euphorbia over there. Little um fairy tale castle cactus. I have one of those. Lots of jade. This is the one I got last time, and I I thought it was a, a Hoya Multiflora, but now I don't think so. <laughs> it is a Hoya, though. The brain cactus? Yeah, they had a bunch right over there. I have a little skull um, 
planter thing, I could put that in. It'd be kind of cool. I like this guy. He's cute, right? Nine ninety nine. They have a lot of cacti today. <gasps> Look at this one. Yeah, the butts. I saw these last time too. It's amazing, $9.99 for that many. I feel like they're usually more pricey than that. Look at that. There's so many in there. I don't do good with those, otherwise I would get one, but I've sadly killed mine. This is cool. Yeah, that was here last time, right? Are you sure? I think so. I love looking at all their cacti, though. They have a lot of really cool ones. Immediately, I like this one. I think I'll get that one. I like this guy, too. So many different kinds. $60. Yeah, there's a little, just a, oh, 30 for this, just one. That's sad. String of hearts. I know. Truly. Look at this guy. <laughs> Toya. The Hoya carry eye. Wow. Sixty. Well, it has more leaves than my variegated one that I got that I paid like fifty for, so. That's not a bad deal for it, well, honestly. You oh yeah. Well, Euphorbia, I forget the name of it. It's like fire something. Really cute little succulent arrangements. Oh, they sold that big, the big Hoya that was here last time. It's this guy, just says succulent. interesting I have no idea what that is it just says foliage pretty pothos philodendron hope for $29.98 that's a cute one. Mine is only three leaves right now. <laughs> oh, look at this. You got a... Uh, it just says hybrid philodendron. I think it's like a... I'm not sure. Congo red, maybe? really cool. 
<laughs> it is, yeah. Mine will get that way if I let it. They grow so fast. I do, I just have a very small one. Some pink syngonium over here. $29.98 for that. Really healthy. Yeah, I just wanted a little guy though. Peperomia frost. Everybody has the oxalis out. $14.98. Cute little airplane display. They didn't have this last time. Fifty. This is a really nice Schaeflera. I want mine to get that big. Pretty rubber trees. Some little lipstick plants over here. $14.98. Some Marantas. I don't have any of these guys. It's a curly lipstick plant. It's cool. There's more of the the frost. Fourteen ninety eight. We have Peperomia Rana Verde. Looks like all of the the ones this size are fourteen ninety eight. Little teeny. Look how small the little purple passion plant. So cool is a kale. Yeah, look at this kale. I don't know what this is, but it's cute. Okay, back over here. I really want to get this guy. If I can grab it without getting poked. Yeah. Isn't it cute? Down here, there's a bunch more.
Everything's really cool. Cal and Koei something. <laughs> Twelve ninety-eight. Look at that guy. Okay. I know I saw that one, huh? You see the price? Uh-huh. I showed them too on camera. Interesting. So yours is probably worth like seven hundred dollars. <laughs> Talking about my Hoya carry eye that I've shown you guys in the past. And it's funny how they sell just the one leaf <laughs> for 30. All right. Oh, that one is cute. Is that another Carolyn Coley or? Oh, Crassula. He's really cute. Here's an aloe. How worthy oities. That's really adorable. I like this fuzzy guy. I had a Kalankoe Tomentosa and I killed it, sadly. I think I overwatered it. So I'm trying to avoid the the fuzzy succulents for now. This one's cute. It looks like a flapjack plant, but it's a Kalankoe. Are all of them Kalankoe's? I don't know. This is really cool. Echeveria Desert Coral Crest. So we just finished at Wilmore Nursery. It's a lot smaller than most of the other ones, so I only ended up getting one plant. But we are headed over to the gardens in Highlands Ranch, and hopefully they got their new shipment in. Really pretty African violets. Look at that one. This thing is cool because the stripes look painted on almost. I don't know what it is. It just says house plant. I would guess some type of like agave or haworthia, but I don't know. <laughs> the big yucca. Look at these massive aloes. This one's cool. 59 look at this guy. $59.99. Big fiddle leaf fig tree.
some Chinese evergreen ZZ plants. Got some Thanksgiving cactus. And over here, there's some asparagus fern, golden pothos, got some monstera adansonii. Let's see how much theirs is. $29.99. That's not bad at all for that. It's huge. How much? Six hundred. Two fifty for that? Yeah, I thought it was gonna be a lot more. I thought so too. If you want a gigantic uh, fiddly fig tree for two fifty, <laughs> come here. The little ones are thirty four ninety nine for this this one. Got some crotons over here. I'm not a fan of crotons. And then our little fairy garden or terrarium plants. This red fetonia is really pretty. Ooh. I have a pink one and a white one. Do I need a red one? Lots of peperomias. There's some snake plants over here. snake plants oh those are huge $39.99 yeah they don't that was a good find Really pretty philodendron, Prince of Orange. These guys are $29.99. They have really great prices here. Look at this. These are only $24.99. It's huge. 50 for a Monstera this big. That's awesome. Oh my god, that's a peace lily. Kidding. Oh my goodness. That's, wow, I've never seen one that big. That's awesome, look at the flower. I didn't know they could get that big, did you? I like all the little fountains and stuff, it's so peaceful. Ooh, this monster. How much is this guy? 150. That's impressive. Domino piece willy. More snake plants. I don't know what this one's called. I like it. It's like solid 
dark green. Some more Adansonii. These ones are only 20 for this size. I don't think I'll get anything here. Oh, that's really cool. Look at that. It's a Euphorbia, I think. 100 bucks for that. That's a really good price for that size. Wow. That's really pretty. Okay. No. No. I don't do plants. We're about to go into Tagawa now. It's my favorite nursery, and Jesse got me a gift card for Valentine's Day, so yay. Yeah, that's fine. I like this begonia, I don't know what kind it is. It's pretty. Look at his flowers. All the little fairy garden plants. Look, they have them too. Everywhere's getting these in right now. I have these, but the all the leaves fell off. Four ninety nine. Could get a replacement. I got one of these last time I was here. Philodendron lemon lime. These are really cool. I dropped the little thing. It's a dumb cane, but it's like a different leaf pattern. Isn't that pretty? Look at this one. $64.99. This is the same size as the ones that were like $24. No questions? Yeah, no, I was I think these are the ones people call like the rattlesnake calatheas. That is really cool. I don't know what that is.
The one I have like this is so sad right now. There's like a really good one back there. Little oh, Bond's eyes. I don't know. <laughs> you can make it a bonsai. Look how big this ZZ plant is. That guy is 110. And this size is 60. Thank you. Oh my goodness, it's so small. That's where I got my first one. Was here, but that was a long. Th that was last summer, I think. That's a Tradescantia. I have them, but small. It's related to the one that you keep saying we should get more of. Okay, it's the same color. It is. Look at this alocasia. No. Just fatter? 
Yes. I think so. I should have got the one at NYX, the the Australis. I should have got you a NYX gift card. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll definitely <laughs> use it here. Plus, it doesn't expire, so yeah, I can use it over summertime too. Yeah, keep your stock inside. yeah. these are huge crotons. Wow, sixty. If I liked crotons, then these would be good ones. <laughs> I had one from like Home Depot, but he got spider mites and died. And I swore never again because crotons are just not my thing. Very colorful. Echeveria Lola. I'm not good with this kind of succulent, but it's really cute. Oh, here's a variegated Kalinkoe Melodia. That's really pretty. More lithops. Six ninety nine. And that is everything. Um, we ended up going to Lowe's afterward as well so I could pick up some orchid bark and then I ended up grabbing a few succulents there as well so I will go ahead and include those. However, I did not film the Lowe's. So the first plant that I got today is this jewel orchid in a six inch pot. I paid $44.99 for this one, and this one I did get at NYX. I've actually been wanting one of these for a really long time, and I haven't been able to find it. It was the very first place we stopped, and it was probably one of the first plants I noticed. And I decided I had to grab it, so I'm really excited about it. Orchids are my all-time favorite plant. I'm not great with them, but this one actually grows in soil rather than bark. Um, so I think I'll do a little better with it. The next plants I have are from City Floral, and I got this Peperomia Frost. This one is in a four inch pot and I paid $6.99 for this one. I love Peperomia and I actually don't have this one yet so I was really excited to add it to my collection. I love the kind of metallic look to the leaves. The icy look, hence the name Frost. Very cute. And then this one is in a two and a half inch pot. It is some kind of cactus, although it does not say the name. And you guys know I'm not great at identifying cacti, so I'm actually not sure what this is. I just thought it looked really cool. And it seems to have kind of stripes on it, almost, with variegation. Just super interesting. I've never seen this one before. I have a couple that look similar to this, but they're like all green and a little rounder. And the last one from City Floral is this one. And I paid $4.99 for this one. I also don't know what it is. I believe it's related to one that I got in my last haul video where I surprised my friend Ashlyn. Um... I actually have it next to me. Let me see if I can grab it and show you what I mean. So I think these two are related. Just different kinds. And this one's actually grown 
since I showed you guys a couple weeks ago, it's kind of turning into a, a cone shape. It was very round when I first picked it up. All right, and then the next plant that I have is from Wilmore Nursery. That was the kind of smaller one, um, but they had a really great selection of cacti and succulents. And so I got this one. It's a Opuntia ficus indica variegated. I, again, don't know a lot about cacti, um, but I liked this one because it was variegated. It's just a cute little guy. This one I paid $6.98 for. I ended up not getting anything from the gardens and I also did not get anything from Tagawa. I really debated picking up one of the exotic orchids. However, like I said, I'm not that great with orchids and it was $40. And I didn't want to risk it. Um, I do have a gift card there, though, from Jesse for Valentine's Day. And it doesn't expire. So I would imagine I'll be spending that very shortly. And, of course, I'll film whatever I end up buying <laughs> and show you guys. Um, the last plants are from Lowe's, which I did not film. But they're cute little ones, so I wanted to show you. I also found... A Hoya there that I do not have and it's this Hoya Bilobata. Look at this. My neighbors are being loud, excuse them. This one, I don't know what size this is. I'm not great at measuring, um, but I paid $16 for this one. And it's severely overwatered. Um, it was leaking water when I picked it up, like pouring out. So I'm actually going to repot that one as soon as I stop filming. Because um, it definitely did not need the water. But I was really excited to find that. And then I found a bunch of cute little succulents for um, $2 each. So I got this bear paw succulent. I've had one of these before. I did kill it within a couple weeks, and I don't know why. Um, if you guys have any advice on those, let me know how you keep yours alive. And then I got a Kalanchoe tomentosa or panda plant. I also used to have one of these, and it died. That one was definitely due to overwatering. Um, I kept it alive for maybe six months and then it ended up perishing. This next one is, I don't even know how to pronounce this, Adromitius cristatus, key lime pie succulent, but he's very fuzzy, kind of resembles the bear paw succulent. I like the look of it. It kind of reminds me of something you would f like find underwater. And these are all overwatered as well, so I'll definitely be repotting them. I did pick up some fresh terracotta pots. And then the last one is this um, Cotyledon Mint Truffles. So this one is actually related to the bear paw succulent. They're the same family of plants, but this one kind of looks like a, a flapjack. Like a, uh, I think they're crassulas actually. Mm -hmm. It looks like one of those to me, but I thought it was really cute. All right, that is everything for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.